Yeah. What's good? How are you? Everything good? Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. You know? Good, good.
No shackle for a day. No, 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 no,
good men. The Marine! 11 points for the Marine!
play. Nice bucket. Tyler Orbison, I went to Roosevelt Catholic and I play at Syracuse University. And what year are you? A junior. What's your goals for next year? Uh, next year my goals are to uh, basketball. Wise. Basketball is your uh, My goals are to come in and help the team and have a bigger role now that I'm going into my junior year. And school wise, what's your goal? Um, to decide on a major and figure out. <laughs> Hopefully I can play um, in the NBA someday and if not, um, I definitely want to play pro somewhere. On the court, what's your, how would you describe your style? Fashion wise? Off the court? On the court. My style on the court. <laughs> I'm pretty chill. Like, I'm, I'm not huge in the fashion. I just wear whatever looks nice. 
favorite sneakers away? Um, Kobe's. No typical Jordans like everyone else. I mean, if, if I see a pair that I like, I'll get them. But I'm not, I'm not huge into them. Like I won't try to get every pair that comes out. Nah. Who's your favorite artist? Uh, probably I'll have to go with J Cole or Fab. When did you um, figure like you know you were gonna take ball serious? Um, probably I would say when I got to maybe eighth grade. What made you decide on Syracuse? Um, I wanted to go to a, a huge, like a powerhouse basketball school, and, um, and basically they were really close. That and I, I, uh, I felt good there when I saw my visit with my teammates and coaches. How do you feel about the situation that's going on with the um, the all the stop, the restrictions and everything? Um, it was tough last year. I mean, we didn't, we didn't have the opportunity to play in the tournament, but um, it really sucked for the seniors. But I was only a sophomore, so I, I have a couple of years to play. So um, I'm looking forward to that. And why did you come to Post City? Why did I come to Post City? Um, well, for sure, out to Post City. <laughs> I heard it was real big, so I wanted to come. And this team specifically? Um, how did you get on it? Uh, I, I knew somebody that played on this team, so they told me I could play. Yeah. Cool, are you going to play next week? Yeah, I'll be here. I'll be here for the rest of the summer. All right, fam. Thank you. No problem. Thank you. Michael Poole from Queens, New York. I played at Rutgers and Iona. Why two schools? Why two schools? My coach, I got fired at Rutgers. So I wanted to go play with my friends at Iona, so I did. Who are your friends? My friends, I had a bunch of guys on the team. Kelvin Amayo, David Lowry, a couple guys. Isaiah Williams, a couple guys I grew up with. I wanted to play college with them. Where are you doing, sir? They come in here with me? Yeah, he's one as well. That's how I told you to be. How you doing, sir? Who's that? Kelvin Amayo with the high school. What did you study? Study criminal justice. I had made, my major was criminal justice. I was a double minor in labor studies and sociology. Are you going to do anything? Oh, no, no, no. I don't want to be a cop or nothing. Basketball is my career. What's your goal as far as basketball? Look, basketball take me as far as it can, you know. Win some championships overseas, NBA. That's the goal to get to the NBA one day, so still striving for that. And hopefully it happens. If not, overseas careers, not too bad. During the summer, I play with Sean Bell and everything. Sean Bell All Stars, the best team in the city. No, it's not. <laughs> no, it's not. See, where are you from? We, we got chips. Yeah, I got chips. <laughs> You're not the best where are you playing with Sean Bell? Sean Bell in Pro City, Hoops in the Sun, Tri State, Watson, Gersh Park, Ball Up, and that's about it, I think. And what's your favorite tournament? Pro City. I love Pro City. Hoops in the Sun, too, is coming up. My first year Hoops in the Sun, I actually enjoy playing in it. So I would say between Pro City and Hoops in the Sun. Why? Well, it's the most pro. NBA, NBA kind of game, you know, they, they follow the exact NBA format, so you learn how to play the NBA game in only these two tournaments, more like Dykeman and Trusty, you know, it's like the one-on-one -on -one stuff for certain guys who can excel in that. I, I'm more of a NBA type of style guy, so I like the game that they play in Hoops and Sunny Pro City. How would you describe your style? Uh, I, I'm a fashion, I, I like, I, I think I'm a fashion like group. I think I put a lot of people on to my, I, I make my own clothes, I'm more like, I'm an innovator, I'm a stylish guy. And if you don't believe me, you can follow my Instagram. I'm one of those cool guys. If you look at me now, I got Vans on, short, you know what I'm saying? Long tees. That's just how it's just. <laughs> but, is, is, is it not? Do I not put, do I, do I not do this shit? <laughs> on the court, I like to wear um, Nikes. Nike guy. I always grew up in Nike system, uh, from when I was a little kid. I always grew up in the Nike brand leagues and teams. So I'm just so accustomed to wearing Nike stuff. As far as music goes, who's your favorite artist? Kanye West. My Kanye. I think he's just the greatest rapper of all time. I think he's an innovator too at rapping. I think like he changed the rap game. He changed the youth. I mean, he his music is good. He changes. Oh, he's never the same over the years. He's always changed, doing different things, and I like that. You dress like him? I don't. I don't aim to, but people say I do. But that's not my intentions. I don't look at Kanye's world. Do I? Dress like Kanye. And as far as the summer goes, um, what would you say is the top song? Your top, top song? song or top song period? Travis right Scott and the Dope. That's your top song? That's the top, no, it's the top song. The top song if you haven't heard it, listen to it. Travis Scott and the Dope. Do you live there by any quotes or mantras? Um, there's no friends in the game. I don't, I don't consider anybody on the basketball court a friend of mine. Every time I step on the court, it's to win and to be the best, so that's a quote I live by when I'm playing basketball. And how about in life? In life, um, you can't control what happens to you. You only can control how you, how you respond. Great quote. If you ever need your jeans, then I charge $75 to do jeans. 
know what I'm saying? Like kind what? of like, do what? rip them up, distress, you know, distress them, make them look older, make them look like this what's, what's hot nowadays, you know what I'm saying? Mills! Uh, Oklahoma, yo, me. You was playing, you could've got 50. It was there. You look dead, I said, go get you some water. That's why I said that. You look like you about to, you was slaving out there, bro. <laughs> Let me throw the gold rope out here. Oh, get out of here. He's getting to it. Let me take the book back. Let me take the book back off. Let me Let me help you out here. You gotta give a hug. like you don't know what's going on. You have to watch it, you feel me? You know what I'm saying? Oh my gosh. Oh, you're right. I'm gonna get a lot of comments on this joint right here. I'm gonna holler. Oh, you gonna see, you following that. You gonna. I saw it live, I'm good. You gonna you gonna see the gram, you gonna like it. I really wanted to go to Pizza Jam. Um, I can get on that same train. Either white train or I can go to Portchester. So you could go to Stanford, right? I could. And it goes to Portchester. <laughs> Oh. We got you, we got you. No, 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 he's the one who grabbed me. What were you doing? I grabbed him and he grabbed you. If he was fall and he would fall on you. But I grabbed him just in case. She wasn't falling. She, she, she just did her one, two step. And <laughs> he grabbed you. Nah, I'm good listen. now. Nobody grabbed me though. I could have I put that. Let's go. This is up here.